Hey guys, the Dexavi here once again, leaving right where we left off on the cliffhanger. There's one person left to murder in the Dark Brotherhood. And I want to say, wasn't there like a little girl running around? Oh, what the heck? Oh, the tenants. Yeah. But I don't know, this game doesn't let you kill girls. Or not girls. <laughs> it doesn't let you kill girls. It <laughs> doesn't let you kill children. Festus Crex. That, that didn't sound like a kid. I guess the kid's just not going to be in here. Alright, here we go. <laughs> oh shit! Oh dude, you were on fire! Did you see that? I'm gonna give you a second to take care of that. I'm You've got your own issues before Iguana Man showed up. Oh my why is he on fire? Ah Festus cracks, come on. Yeah. Oh shit. Ah. Is this guy a vampire or something? I haven't lived this long to be beaten by you. Come on, burn all your mana. Burn it all. Yes. All is going according to plan. Okay, Festus. Oh, you kinda hurt. You're kinda yeah, you are definitely a vampire or something. There's some dark magic about you. What black sorcery is this? <laughs> Come here, dude. Ow! Okay, fine, you know what? We're gonna we're gonna use some potions here. It's a smart thing to do. Drought of resist fire, yes, that sounds awesome. We're gonna poison my sword. Cool, I didn't know you could poison... Well, I guess I didn't know that, but... That just makes it so much more overpowered. You can freaking poison a, uh... Blade that already doesn't affect. Get down. Oh, wow, you're a pussy! Pussy vampire! Festus Crex. Shrouded robes. Nah, I don't need any of that. Alright. Report back to Commander Mara. Oh, what is this? Just a little... Wait, can I walk through this? Just see through. It's a beautiful work of art. Some dark art right there. Hold on, I want to see if we can see the Night Mother. I forget where she's at. In this one. Or, or, or is she even in here? Do you have to like go and get the Night Mother? I, I've actually forgotten how that goes. I don't know. But uh, I guess we'll go talk to Command tomorrow. And is this really it? Wow. I can't believe it. Iguana Man's done it. God, I'm such a freaking hero. I wonder why uh, Farkas didn't follow me. He probably saw that door. He's like, dude, I am not going through a door that just spoke to me. Like it was a person. And a weird, creepy person at that. You can't blame him. I mean, if I saw that door and it started whispering to me some weird, creepy shit like that, i no, going the other way. <laughs> Apprentice assistant. Yeah. All right. My work here is done. <laughs> I came, I saw, I conquered. Oh man. That is the iguana way. <laughs> Bet you're feeling real stupid now, aren't you? Stupid skull door. Yeah. He's like, uh, my one job. Not let people in here who aren't in the Dark Brotherhood. Not only did someone come in, it's not like he was just a solicitor either. He, uh, he wanted to kill everybody. So, yeah. <laughs> That's a mistake you're going to have to deal with for the rest of your life, Dor. For the rest of your life. All the rest of your days, you're going to look back on this day. Wish you could have done it differently. But you can't change time. Time keeps on uh, trekking forward. You know what I mean? Sorry, excuse me, Farkas. I was just, uh, just talking some shit to that door. Alright, anyways. Let's go see what Commander Morrow has in terms of compensation. Okay. What's up, dudes? <clears throat> I'm back. He's probably like, wow. This guy's going to be really impressed with me. He sent me alone to do a mission that their entire, like, freaking squads couldn't carry out. I better be freaking rolling in the cash after this. Guana Man needs it to uh, pay for all of his expensive hobbies. He likes to, um, he likes to set up croquet, uh, like, Obstacles, I guess, in or I don't know, obstacles, uh, courses really in the wilderness. Play the croquet with all of his rich hobnobby friends, and um, yeah. So I you need a you need to pay for that. Can it be true? It is true. Have you actually done it? Yep. This is a great day, my friend. You have struck a blow against darkness that will not <laughs> yes. soon be forgotten. Here, as promised, a most generous reward. Yes. Three thousand gold. Yes. <laughs> wow. 
Did I actually just complete a quest line on YouTube? I think that actually happened. <laughs> oh, I know everyone's talking shit like, Tex, you never finish anything. What? I get distracted and I want to play other things sometimes. <laughs> it happens. But I freaking, I did this. Command tomorrow. You're probably my friend now. Can I just kill, what would happen if I just killed these two people? Let's just save and find out. Because I need my blade to continue getting stronger. That's it. Actually, Command Amora was probably a main character, I would think. But we're gonna try! Yeah. He's not even fighting. He doesn't want to mess with somebody. Aw, oh, dang it. Well, might as well just freaking load freaking main characters, ruining all my fun. Ugh. I feel like an obl Oblivion to not have as many main characters. I don't know. Seems like every time I want to go on a murdering spree, half the people can't even be killed. Be lost. It's stupid. The down the road it's be. stupid. Hmm. Well, that was... Oh, I didn't expect it to be done this quick, I'm going to be honest. Alright, so now the question is, what is next for Iguana Man? And I think... That should be left up to the viewers. So let's see. I've done the Fighters Guild. I've done the Civil War quests. Um, I, I think I've finished yeah, I every single main quest line, actually, except Thieves Guild, although I don't know. Shadow might have been already uploaded by the time y'all are seeing this. So, man, I've actually I've done some major work on here. I have not done the main quest. I don't know if that's something y'all would want to see, because I feel like everyone and their uh, mother and uh, stepbrother have finished the main quest, so... I don't know, but y'all leave me a comment down below what's next for Iguana Man, our scaly hero. But, um, yeah, as for now, we've accomplished it. We have purged this land of the darkness. As he said, a darkness has been lifted from this land, and who better than Iguana Man to carry that out? Freaking hero. Can I see, like, do I have some fame or anything? Is that how this works? I've been playing way too much Oblivion. I'm stuck in that, like, mindset. Oh, I have to press start. That's right. Alright. Let's see. <laughs> 56 malls. That's the first thing I read. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't think they have, like, fame anymore. But... Favorite weapon, Ebony Blade? Yeah, that's, that's true. That's true. Favorite shout, Howl of Terror. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Total lifetime bounty. Actually, I have no idea what that's from. Hmm. Yeah, no no fame or infamy. Interesting. Well, these people will soon know me, especially if I do do the main quest. I don't know. For some reason, I have a feeling y'all are going to tell me to do that with this guy. I may be wrong. I don't know. I'll, uh, I'll have to see what y'all say, and we'll go from there. But, yeah, like the video. If you liked it, like I said, tell me what's next for Iguana Man. And don't forget to subscribe. DTEX V signing out.